Hi friends, it's Miss G again. Today, I thought we would um, do this fun activity that I found. It's called Poke a Dot Fun on the Farm. And we count the animals in the barn and on around the farm. Do you think you can help me? Awesome. Okay, so if you'd like to get your own, I have a link below. Um, your mommy and daddy can look at it. And if not, you can help me on our video today. Okay? All right, let's get started. So we have one farmer. There is one farmer. And we're going to press his button. Oh, there he goes. Pop. Okay, let's look at the next one. There are two dogs. Ready? Pop. Pop. Hmm, what are the dogs doing? Are they rounding up the sheep? Yeah? How cool. All right, next we have three, three cats. Ready? One, two, three. What are they looking for? What do you think they're looking for? I wonder if they're looking for the little mice that are that look like they're trying to hide. Do you think maybe they are? Yeah, maybe. Four. Four. Four goats. One, two, three, four. What do they want to climb on? What do you think they'd like to climb on? Maybe the fence? Yeah, maybe. Okay, what number comes next? Can you tell me? Good job. Five. Five horses. One, two, three, four, five. What will the horses eat? Hey, now notice when I'm counting these, I'm putting my finger on each horse and popping the little bubble. That's important when you're counting that you put your finger on each item that you're wanting to count. Because you know what sometimes happens? Sometimes we get really fast and our brains get ahead of like our fingers and we count too many. So we'll go, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Are there 10 horses? No, there's five. And we'd know that if we slowed down and took our time counting and made sure our finger touched each horse as we counted. Okay. All right. What number comes next? What number comes next, you guys? Good job. All right. The number six. We have six ducks. Ready? One, two, three. Four, five, six. What swims below them? What swims below the ducks? Yeah, fishies. Good job. All right, what number comes next? Yeah, you think so? Seven. All right, we have seven sheep. Let's count. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven. What will they nibble? What do you think they'd like to nibble on? Maybe the grass? Yeah. Maybe the flowers. What number comes next? Do you guys know? Yeah, eight chickens. And they're all on their nests. Well, they're eight chicken necks, actually. That's where they go to lay their eggs. Okay, ready to count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight chicken nests and eight chickens who are gonna come sit on their nest to lay eggs. How fun. Okay, what number comes next? Yeah, you think so? All right, let's go over it. Number nine. Good job, guys. So we have nine dirty pigs. Looks like they've been rolling around in the mud. 
Let's count to make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And where do they sit? They sit in the mud, those silly gooses. And last but not least, what number comes next? What number have we been talking about? Yes, number 10. We have 10 cows. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good job. 10 cows. All right, thanks for joining me with my popping activity. I will see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe for our next lesson. Toodaloo!